Okay, as uh, finance spokesperson for the Greens group, I invite you to respond and second the joint amendments on behalf of the Labour and Green group. Thank you, Mr Mayor. Tribalism has long been a fact of British politics and it's often been counterproductive. So I'm very proud and, and honoured that today we can put that aside and the Labour and the Green groups can work together to put forward these joint amendments. I'm sad only that we couldn't save more services. This joint amendment has a raft of important proposals, including putting 200,000 back into connections, which has had its budget slashed again and again over the past 12 months. But I'd like to highlight just a few of the proposals here. Firstly, as has been rehearsed now um, ad infinitum, removal of the cycle lane. It's just absurd to spend £1.1 million removing a cycle lane when the casualty statistics are down 20% for that area. It just makes no sense. On food waste, 35% of municipal waste is food. It makes perfect financial and environmental sense to do something more productive with that food than to incinerate it or stick it into landfill. By pushing forward this pilot, we'll be looking to save money for future years when we know further cuts are coming. On the issue of public protection, it's the very definition of false economy, Mr Mayor, to be cutting back on those officers who deal with licensing, who deal with food safety and trading standards. When we say our economy is a tourist economy, it's utter madness, and I cannot believe the Tories are pushing that forward. Well, I can, actually. Uh, <laughs> There is huge uncertainty in these proposals here, which is why the joint amendments put aside additional reserves to deal with the, the unknowns and the unknown unknowns, because there is so little detail on this budget. I will speak on it further when um, I speak to the Greek, Green Amendments, but I just want to reiterate how, how happy I am that we've been able to put forward some joint amendments, and it's, it's a sign of, of how um, cross-party politics can be effective, and I, I commend the amendments to the whole Council and hope you'll support them. Thank you.